how to make your PC run faster and smoother hello and welcome to easy tech geek today in this short video you will learn how to make a slow a dead computer in a brand new computer the performance of the computer will be way better than earlier and if you're looking for some you know fancy softwares which will make your computer like supersonic missile or etc this video is not for you but yes if you're looking for a genuine so way where you can make your computer faster and just like a brand new computer definitely this video is for you and one more thing which I would like to let you know every single step is a gold and it's very basic even a 90 year old non techie person can also perform this step and you should not miss a single part of the video and make sure you do not miss any s steps in the video okay so the very first step is you need to detach all of the hard drive which you have plugged into your computer alright so make sure all the hard drive external hard drive I'm talking about make sure it's been plugged out and then you just need to do a right click on the start button or just type in the search bar run here you will find the run app and a run window will open up like this alright so we have deta detached the external hard drive we will just type clean MGR this is the first step I know it's very basic but we will perform this first step so once we click on clean MGR we just have to click on OK so here a screen will come up like this and it will have temporary internet files uh, recycle bin all the junks which we have in our computer it will clean up the whole uh, you know the bad files the files which is not created by us it is actually created by the computer so once you select all these things just click on OK so what we have done we have opened up the run window and here we have typed clean MGR and clicked on OK and it has opened up the disk cleanup utility utility this is the first step you have done now you need to install CCleaner in your computer okay and make sure while installing the CCleaner you are not installing any additional software you know which they actually prompts that okay uh, download the PC booster and the browser etc make sure you do not install any additional software while installing the CCleaner once the CCleaner is installed I would like you to go ahead and click on this registry option yeah this is the second very important step here once you go to the registry options click on scan for issues and the moment you will hit on scan for issues it will start detecting all the bad registries you know the registries which is created by softwares or the perform uh, steps which we do whatever we do in our computer it create backlogs you know which we don't require in, a, in our computer and also if we uninstall or install any software it create traces and we do not require those so since my computer is absolutely optimized I have got only 12 registries there are computers where I used to see um, more than 50,000 registries sitting on the computer and making the computer slow so once you click on scan for issues you just have to click on review selected I do not take any backup I just say no and I click on fix all selected issues in this manner all the bad registries have been deleted from my computer that's the second step now we will move to the third important step which is absolutely critical and you um, should not miss without fail so here we need to go to tools and tools we need to select the startup here make sure the C cleaner should be disabled from the startup and all unnecessary applications should be disabled from the startup now the reason why I ask you to 
uh, stop these applications at the startup. There are many applications which we never require always. Yes, like I, you, I'm, I'm using Photoshop, but I don't uh, need that every time whenever I open my computer. So I actually disable it at the startup. So make sure all the unnecessary unwanted applications are disabled from the startup. Then we just need to go to the custom clean. That's the fourth important step. And here you just need to click on analyze. Once you will click on analyze, it will ask you to close the browsers or etc. That's fine. I just clicked on yes. It will start, you know, checking for cache or the junk which is there in the machine. So currently it has removed 670 megabytes of junk from my computer. It has analyzed it. I just have to click on run cleaner and all the junks will be dis uh, deleted. You can share this video to your family, uh, friends and make sure if you have any um, doubt you can have a paper and pen handy note down all the process so there are only five steps which you have to do and you just need to restart the computer and trust me your computer will be way better way faster than earlier okay and uh, always uh, update your windows okay that's a very important part and make sure you should have an antivirus program the windows defender the office uh, microsoft um, antivirus program is enough to secure your computer and if you have any other application that's fine make sure that is updated so that's all for now hit that subscribe button and like button for that video i need your support guys please support me you have a wonderful day ahead take care bye bye